So today I have an Excel challenge for you, and we're calling this the Equal Playing Time Challenge. So the backstory here is that my sister helps manage her son's basketball team, and she called me up yesterday and said, we have a math problem that we need some help with. And so here's the challenge. They have 12 players on the team, and there are nine periods in the game. Yes, nine periods in a basketball game. They're five-year-old kids, so they need a lot of activity and something to keep them busy. And then there are five players that can play during a period. And so the challenge here is how do we get equal playing time for each player on the team throughout the entire game? And as a bonus, there are also six games in the season. So if we can't get equal playing time during one single game, is it possible to get equal playing time throughout the entire six game season? So your mission, if you choose to accept, is to create a spreadsheet that helps the coaches manage this process. It would be a roster or a list of the players and which periods of the game they would be playing in in order to get that equal playing time. And you can design it any way you'd like, again, to help make it easy uh, for the coaches. And we also have a prize for this. So anyone that enters a solution here, submits a solution, uh, whether it's right or wrong, if you submit a solution, we'll enter you in a drawing to win a free license of our Hero Tools add-in, which is a $199 value. Uh, and we'll have a link right below this video here uh, with all the details on how to submit your solution. Of course, you can leave a comment below this video with your solution and then post a link to uh, a file on SharePoint or OneDrive or something like that. Uh, or we have a place where you can upload a file and share it that way. And again, there'll be a link in the description below to a blog post that explains all the rules of the challenge in more detail. It'll also let you download this file here, uh, which will allow you to just get started with the challenge. So I hope this is uh, an exciting challenge for you. Uh, of course, with Excel, there's a lot of different ways to solve this, and I'm excited to see all the different solutions. And I'll be back with a video that walks through some of the most popular solutions as well. So good luck with this one. Leave a comment below if you have any questions. Thanks again for watching. Have a great day, and we'll see you in the next video.